Welcome back to Wimbledon Threads. Fashion fans, we've got the tea. Yeah, you asked me yesterday, don't mean that it's gonna be yesterday. No, no. I ain't got no guests today, sit down, I can give you the estimate. In addition to strawberries and cream and a nice cold glass of Pims, it seems that Wimbledon wouldn't be Wimbledon without Ralph Lauren in this story. And I actually got this jacket the other day. It's the one. I love it. I'm gonna put it on again for like the 20th time. Okay, I honestly don't know if I've ever needed a jacket more than I need this. Look at the back. A tip of the day, I learned last week the proper way to drape the sweater. So you cross it in front, have it just above your breastbone, pop the collar a little bit, and then you take the sleeves and roll it up once. There is the classic Ralph look. And you pop the collar. So, any fashion inspiration that you guys look to for Wimbledon? I typically just go on TikTok, Instagram, see who my favorite people are. I actually just look towards my sister a lot. Oh, she's like, actually, this I'm, is mine. These are her pants. <laughs> oh. Talk to me about the boots. Are they boots? They are boots. They're go-go -go boots. Don't Wait, why are you interviewing me? I'm know. supposed to be interviewing yeah, you. What went through your mind when you're picking out your outfit this morning? Um, not a lot. I stick it on and if it works, it works. It's well put together, so if you, you happen to just dig through your closet and pull this out, I would love to see what it looks like if you're actually going for a full fit. <laughs> Can you tell me what inspired your look for today? I love this. <laughs> Good job! Our new presenter, everybody. <laughs> My entire outfit today is Polo Ralph Lauren. You can never go wrong with Wimbledon whites and a stripe set. Of course, green and white is very, very Wimbledon. They also have linen tailoring for everybody, and I have this little sweater draped around my shoulders. Until next time.